Hi there. In this video, I bought two things from Parkside. So, Excel tile chisel bit and angled flat chisel. Okay. So, I'm expecting this one is meant to remove tiles from walls and this for whatever <laughs> you plan on uh, doing. And why I bought them, let me show you in a moment. So, up until now, I only had these things. So, yeah, pointy one, which I think is re-sharpened a few times. These things, this has seen better days. This is a tiny bit newer. Uh, they mostly work, but um, mostly work to just break apart stuff. But if I want to get under something and get it out of there, nah, not really. These things mostly want to dig in. So, these uh, things came uh, at Lidl and I said, these are freaking awesome for getting stuff, spreading stuff uh, apart. Je I don't know, getting something off uh, cement uh, or something like that. So, uh, yeah, bought them. They were fairly cheap, obviously. Um, if you want to see the info, here it is. Presumably this one also has it. The connection on them, I think most likely it's SDS Plus. I think that's the the name of the connection itself. So uh, yeah, should be working with uh, most things. Let me see. They tell us to rotate and get it out. That's what I'm doing. Nice. Also rotate and get it out. So, add it to the arsenal and we will put them to good use and I'll get back to you if the, I feel the material is good or there are none, uh, no, no other problems. Hopefully they aren't, but we'll see. Because in these things, for example, the material is quite okay. Normally, I think this actually came with uh, the tools when I bought them, but yeah, I needed something with more surface area. Finally, I think it's time has come. We need to put flooring in this room and the guy that made the room, as you can see, left all sorts of things that need to be removed so we don't have uh, problems. Let's see, will it work or not? Ah, damn it, this one doesn't know just to hammer without rotating. I need to get another one. Okay, I would say that's working. Let's uh, lower the volume a bit. Okay, this is doing exactly what it needs to do. Now, uh, just need to continue with all of them. In this corner, there was much more of that. Uh, I think it's some kind of concrete, no clue. Or when he filled up the walls, uh, no idea. But anyway, this thing took it off like a champ and it doesn't uh, feel much when doing that. So that's great. And this is how it looks after uh, I cleaned everything I needed from that room. Barely no signs on it. Yes, obviously, if you work on it uh, really hard directly into concrete or pieces of stone, who knows what, yeah, it will start to get damaged. But the material overall, really good. And uh, yeah, for me, that's about it. I don't foresee having uh, to use this thing uh, too soon now, so I will not be waiting two years uh, 
to give you this video. If you see something like this, if you think you need it, yeah, get it. They are good materials and uh, they work really well to scrape stuff uh, off. And to presumably make a bit of a channel in something in case you need it. And that's about it. For this one, I didn't have a job yet, but same thing, quite sure. So yeah, hope this, this video helps you. In which case, please give it a like, check out my other videos, and as always, see you in the next one. Bye. And obviously you can ask me in the comments how this work over the years if I somehow have other jobs for them. Bye again.